It truly is a special place, a stadium every football fan should visit should he or she get the chance. The Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Real Madrid up against Real Betis. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Committed challenge. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. Top class defending. Well, here's the Betis starting 11. Claudio Bravo is the goalkeeper. Bartra plays alongside Herman Pezzella in central defence. Canales plays with Juanmi on the flanks. And the central striker is Borja Iglesias. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. There to take it away. Vinicius Junior. The Marengues have lost the ball. Borja Iglesias. Andres Guardado. Now with Iglesias. Will it happen for them? Well, it looked as though they might be in just for a second or two. Casemiro. Benzema. Rodrigo. Lucas Vasquez. Luka Modric. It's Modric taking the infield route. And it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here's the replay, and you just have to admire the patience of the passing as they look for that defence-splitting ball. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Andres Guardado keeping the ball moving Rodriguez not a clear foul but the referee letting the play flow Canales will he play it in Canales and Real come away with it well, the hosts, as you can see, haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Borja Iglesias. On the offensive, and the poor touch didn't help them on the possession front. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Casemiro. Modric. Now Casemiro. Modric. Chance here. In it goes. Delighted to be two in front. Things look good for them now. 
Well, here's the replay, and in many ways, it doesn't do justice to how patient they were in the build-up. Just so composed, waiting for the right moment, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. And that is that half time here in the Spanish capital. Well, the ball moving again, and Real very much in charge of this one. Mendy is with Vinicius Jr. Juan Mi on the ball. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Guardado. Well, they keep the ball moving. Fekir. Just couldn't capitalise there. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? And that's the way to keep the ball out of the net. Well, he doesn't get enough on it, does he? That's too easy for the goalkeeper, I think. David Alaba. Casemiro. Karim Benzema. It's with Vinicius Junior. Benzema takes it forward now. And into the last 30 minutes now. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Guardado. Well, I couldn't quite find his teammate. Keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Tony Kroos. And space for them here on the flank. Teammates in the middle. He knows he's got to react. Well, they survived the attack. Borja Iglesias. Read it well. Well, as you can see, Real Madrid have controlled the possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent. Oh, Stuart, they might be onto something here. And the keeper showing tremendous command. been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches trying to pick out a teammate did his job defensively Alaba under pressure doesn't seem to be bothering him Determined block and space to cross it, cuts it back. Ten minutes to go. Now, can they counter clinically and return to Fekir? Guardado, no high quality defending. Guardado. Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. Yeah. 
So making the substitution now. And over comes the corner. Not quite spot on with that one. Benzema. The ball with Luka Modric. Marco Asensio. Lucas Vasquez. Luka Modric. Asensio pulls it back. Modric! And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And the referee says that will do it. It's the end of the game and it's a victory for Real Madrid. No fans are going to be happy with this. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. And they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. A positive night's work for Karim Benzema. Sum up his performance for us. Yeah, I think the only thing you could question, could he have been a touch more clinical in front of goal? Maybe should have had two or three today. Regardless of that, it was a good performance and a great result.